The spring and fall migrations of birds in North America are amazing feats of strength and endurance. During the northern journeys to their breeding grounds and on the southern fall flights back to the birds' wintering areas, the energy requirements and the physical demands on birds of all sizes are substantial. For example, an average female or hen mallard will burn approximately 1.8 million calories during her 2,400 kilometer journey from southern Louisiana to the Canadian prairies. Some species of migrating birds make their journeys with no stops and the trips may span several days. Other birds will fly from one feeding and rest area to the next and their survival and reproductive success depends on these areas being available to them. The energy that powers the bird's flight muscles is stored in fat in the bird's bodies. We know that for people there can be health risks associated with carrying extra weight on our bodies. However, for migrating birds at certain times of the year, fat is fit. Wetlands provide essential feeding and rest areas for migrating birds. They are bird buffets and are filled with plants, snails, water beetles, and other insects. The food consumed in these wetlands allows the birds to store more fat and are critical for reproductive success. Wetlands on the breeding grounds are also very important because females need additional calcium, protein, and other nutrients for the production and incubation of eggs. Conservation of wetlands along the migration routes and on the breeding grounds is critical for the reproductive success and for the survival of waterfowl.